every time it says Ghostbusters, you're supposed to turn around. Getting me to stand upright on rollerblades is one thing. Getting me to turn on a dime is another. So what are we doing here? We're going to do a spin, a two-foot spin. Okay. Okay, we're just going to walk around. Get comfortable. The Nampa Roller Drome is an institution. You can't find too many people around these parts who didn't go as a kid or have a kid that's enjoyed going around in circles hour after hour. We have grandparents that skated here when they were in high school in the 50s. Okay. And they come back with their children who come back with their children. So it's generational and they all can still skate usually. Ray Lenti, an established skater himself from Vancouver, Washington, always enjoyed competitive skating, and then one day something caught his eye. When I first saw the roller drone for sale, it was a classified ad in the Oregonian newspaper about this big roller skating rink for sale and a phone number. And that was enough for him to move his family east to the Treasure Valley. The Napa Roller Drone has been offering kids a safe place to come and have fun since 1948. Everybody comes in and it's a happy, friendly atmosphere. We don't have anyone having any kind of problems. We all get along. And if you ever wondered why it's called the roller drome. A dome ceiling, a dome roof, so it's a drome. I'm not sure if that's correct, but that's my understanding. And that's all you need to know located right downtown. It's worth lacing them up and taking a few laps. Just remember, when you hear Ghostbusters, turn around. Don Nelson, Idaho News 6.